Hey guys, uh, welcome back. I just wanted to talk you through the connection types with the advanced training collar and our other pro products. Um, still a little bit of confusion out there uh, with customers uh, wanting to know how to connect the collar. Um, so I wanna show you those. There's two types of connection. One, the first connection type is AP mode. Now AP mode or access point, uh, please Google it or look on Wikipedia about it. Um, it's not Bluetooth, but similar in a way uh, where the collar will uh, submit its own connection. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna turn the collar on, um, but instead of just turning it on forward, I'm gonna tilt it and turn it on. Now tilting it, actually connects in a different way. So now we can see Wi-Fi mode on the screen. So if I don't tilt it, it won't access Wi-Fi mode. If I turn it on um, upwards like this, that's the other mode. So that's our internet mode. But, so I'm gonna turn it off, I'm gonna tilt it, I'm gonna switch it on, and now we're in Wi-Fi mode. All right, now, once we're in Wi-Fi mode, very simple to connect. Literally just get your Android device. Um, make sure you have installed the app. And now this is on Wi-Fi. AP is submitting a signal, much like a modem would. And I'm just gonna go into my phone's uh, settings and connections. And where it um, has um, my internet connections, I'm gonna see, oh, fancy AP. So that's the collar showing up. So I'm just gonna hit that. Now I'm connected, and straight away the collar's connected. So that symbol on the collar means the collar's connected. So it's that easy. So the collar is talking direct to the phone. No internet needed. These are just connecting side by side. That is AP mode. And that goes good range. So, you know, most anywhere in the house, um, the collar being made from stainless steel does affect the signal. But on top, that black section there, that's where the antenna is. So that cutaway is for the antenna. So once we're in, uh, we've connected through the settings, that symbol's changed. We're now just gonna access the app. So. If we go into uh, the apps and we hit the app supplied, we've opened it, that's connected. Um, and I'm just tapping the button. You can see the signal change. If I hold that in, it's gonna zap. So now um, everything works. So it's that simple to connect. That's AP mode. I'm just gonna point out this as well. So on the network, on the home page of the app, it's gonna ask you what you wanna connect. So local mode, that's the AP, and then you've got internet mode. So I'm just gonna hit internet mode, I'm gonna connect. Now the app's loaded. Now, we just connected with AP mode. Now we're gonna to connect to the internet. So a little bit different where, so I'm gonna turn the collar off. Now, I'm gonna turn it on facing up. Now, you'll see an IP address, and you'll also see the serial number to your collar on the screen. Serial number is very important because the apps are actually built for each device. So, this app is unique to this collar. What that means is I can't control this collar with any other app unless it's the same serial number. But I can send them that app that I received to my mistress, my master, and then they can control the collar. So you can share that app, but only that app will control this collar. Now, we've turned it on, and we wanna connect this via the internet. So I'm using a MacBook here, because I'm a Mac guy, but you can use PC, it's all the same for this. And you're just gonna go up to your connection. So now connected, I'm just gonna go up here. Now, 
I'm a Mac guy, but uh, it's all the same um, on PC and Mac, just my connections. So where my internet connections are here, you're going to see fancy. So if we highlight that, this window then appears. Um, and what you can see, see there's a few options. Now we just want to configure Wi-Fi. So if I hit that, configure Wi-Fi. Oh, shivers, I've gone too far. We're just going to go back. And this is just going to scan for the internet connection. So now once you've selected the fancy network in the box, you can then search for a connection. So I like to sometimes uh, set up a hotspot on my phone um, for the collar to connect. So you can have that on you if you're taking the collar out and about with your partner in public. Um, or you can connect it to you know, his or her phone. So if they're wearing it and their phone's tethered to the collar to give it internet. So what you're doing is with this menu is you're just selecting whatever network or internet connection you want the, the collar to connect to. So up here I've got my own uh, internet connection and it's like that first time you buy a home um, internet uh, router and you've, you've got to log in and put your password in, it's the same deal. So whatever comes up on here, so hit the scan, that's going to scan around, okay, I've got my home internet, I've got um, a hotspot internet, and I'm just going to connect and I'm just going to put the password in, I've done that. Now the collar uh, will connect. So it's saying credential saved. Oh, you just see that change. So now the collar is connected um, to the internet. So whatever connection you want, and you've entered it there, it's now connected. So now this is connected to the internet. My app's connected to the internet. When I press the button, my... Um, phone is going through the internet to the fancy steel network server so then coming back through the internet down to the collar so this way we can control it from uh, anywhere in the world um, you can see that now we're fully connected so I'm just going to hit the button